and I'm sure you've told the story before, but um, just talk about how you went from that transition to D, D line and how that all worked out, and um, how, how how much <laughs> how, how challenging that was. Oh, uh, jeez, yeah. Go from quarterback to defensive line, um, especially coming out as a freshman, you know, in college. Uh, it, it definitely was a challenge, but uh, me personally, I, I love challenges. So, uh, and I love defense. Um, so when when coach said he's gonna try me out on defensive line, I was just like, all right, I gotta work. Up, put my hand in the dirt instead of you know avoiding the guys who do that. So, um, but uh, see, he's playing quarterback. You, you get all the glory. Yeah. But then when you go back to the trenches, you know, you're doing the dirty work, and you know it's kind of hard to get noticed there. But um, no, I had a lot of fun learning, learning that new position, and you know, just trying to strive and be the best in that that I could be. Did you have the idea that that's what you were going to be doing in college, or did you? Were you yeah, I, um, no, uh, I had a, I had a couple other offers, but it, it was like usually just athlete or okay. uh, outside linebacker or something like that. Because um, I, whenever I talked to the schools, I told them I'd wanted to play defense, so uh, they they always tried to look at me. They didn't really know where I was going to play. But uh, my dad always told me uh, growing up, he's like, I, I feel like you're going to be a DN or D tackle or something like that. Um, just because, you know, Paulies usually just get bigger. So. <laughs> <laughs> how much how much weight did you put on from the end of high school to the begin, right, the first year of college? Um, sheesh. When I came on my visit here, I was like 250. And, and then uh, Coach said, I'm going to try playing defensive line. So I was like, all right. As soon as I went home, I was like, all right, I got to I gotta get, come back bigger. So my freshman year, I played around like 255, 260. Okay. And then now, today, I'm like 280, 285 on a good day. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it, it's definitely harder playing, um, trying to get used to playing at a bigger, you know, bigger dude. But I feel like it helps me out that I played quarterback because the athleticism or something, you know, I'm just used to moving around more. Mm -hmm. Did you? Um, you playing? So you played that? You played quarterback at around two fifteen high school? Or were you a little? Uh, no, I was that? definitely smaller. Okay. Uh, I just got bigger and bigger okay. and bigger. So my sophomore year, I was like 190, 195. Still pretty big for yeah, yeah high school, yeah. right? Uh, and then my junior year, I got up to two twenty five, two thirty. The senior year, I was like two forty five, two forty. Yeah. Probably pretty hard to bring down when you were out. Like, yeah, I mean, I, I, I felt it in my legs. I was getting hit in my legs. Just, nobody <laughs> took me up top, so I was like, right, I got to get used to this. <laughs> um, how has your role morphed from just being, you know, a new defense, new to defensive line now to becoming one of the, the anchor or leader of that defensive line? Yeah. You, you take that pretty seriously. Oh yeah. Um, ever since I got here, I tried taking that serious. Uh, I always wanted to be a leader, just for internal reasons. I feel like. I, that's just what I love to do. I like to make everybody else around me better. But um, yeah, for sure. Um, from going to not knowing what I'm doing to now, I'm, I'm pretty pretty comfortable with my feet wet and in the new position. Uh, I feel like it'll be a good deal this year. Mm -hmm. who, who are some of the other guys that you're looking to step up around on that defensive line? I guess who you can try, you feel like you guys can have a level of comfort with. Right now? Oh yeah, I I I, I can trust anybody on the defensive line. Uh, uh, especially with uh, we got a big Glenn in the middle, and uh, Kevin on the outside mm -hmm. with me. Um, we got the new junior college transfers. Uh, we got Akeem Coleman um, and Ari. Ari, I feel like they they're, they're definitely gonna they definitely help out with our depth, and you can see it, uh, big changes in our in our in throughout the fall camp that we have depth, and it, um, you know once ones are off, twos there's no fall off. So I'm definitely looking forward to the season with that. How, 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 do you, how well do you fit, think you fit in with Coach Presky's system? I know he likes to play multiple different fronts, but he's primarily a three-four guy. Yeah, you feel like that fits pretty well with the personnel. Yeah. That you oh yeah. Oh yeah. We, um, I feel like we we definitely have the personnel to do it, and especially with the, us. Um, we 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 did start off bigger with uh, with our previous years, but um, our defense our D line is starting to get a little bit smaller, so we're be, we're able to move around a lot, and we do a lot of stunts. So with Coach Presky's defense, I feel like we're perfect for it. Do you feel like you're at a pretty good weight with where you, in terms of what you want to be on the field, or would you, you feel like you could even be a little, a little heavier, and still be effective, or is it like yeah, is this is kind yeah, of, is I this definitely what? no, I definitely try to, uh, like on the papers, I would always, I would always try to jump my weight to like <laughs> uh, I want to, I want to, I'm gonna say throw five, whatever. Uh, no, but uh, yeah, I definitely am trying to gain weight. And, I mean, it's kind of hard to do it right now, yeah. fall camp, but uh, yeah, it's. 
it's definitely a challenge, but that's that's something that we all got to work on. One last question. I remember you had a, you had an impact pretty quickly as a fresh, a true freshman, if I remember. Play, you jump, jump. I mean, obviously you were new to the line, but you still yeah, had, you still, still, you still were able to jump in there. Yeah. What, what was that? What was that like? That had, to, that had to feel pretty good. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, it definitely felt good, but I definitely was nervous at yeah. times. I was just yeah. like, geez, like these dudes are even bigger than they, they see on TV, you know. Mm-hmm. And so, uh, just trying to do. I, really, my freshman year was it was kind of tough. I tried to do what, uh, tried to do what you could do, but at the same time, I'm just new to the new to the game. It's a whole new game. Usually I'm sitting back looking for open receivers or running the ball, and now I'm just like trying to read blocks and work on my technique. So, but yeah, I feel comfortable now, so I'm good. Was there anything specifically you had to focus on in those early days? Like you're like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm, I got, I really have to rely on. I'm not, I'm not as nearly as big as I need to be, but I have Jeez, to. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's hands, technique, hands. Uh-huh. technique. Um, my high school coach told me it'd bite me in the ass one day because in high school I kind of could just run around and make plays, but. Um, yeah, uh, it definitely was hands. Just get my hands on the blocks, or uh, really just seeing, believing what I see, and just playing the blocks. But yeah, other than that, did you? Uh, sorry, I, didn't, I guess I didn't ask this. You were obviously quarterback. Were you two way played? Did you play defensive end, defensive or linebacker in high, in high school? Well? No, I, did, just, I did. Just, I did. I did. I, I did a little bit, but um, we they kind of didn't want me to okay. mess mess myself okay. up on defense. Um, but whenever they needed me, and I'd, I'd go on to get a couple snaps, I probably got like. 50 snaps my whole defensive, uh, my whole high school career in defense. So, yeah. The, the, the only question I had a, a few weeks ago, you were named to a watch list of, of Polynesian players, and I know you you call Utah home, but do you still like to stay in touch with the, your heritage? And is that still oh, yeah. a pretty oh, big yeah. honor for you? Oh yeah, if I can, and whenever I do, I, we, I feel like that's for every, any Polynesian. Really, mm-hmm. I feel like whenever um, whenever we get honored with something like that, or with that, especially with. Uh, that I was shocked. I didn't even know that until my buddies was telling me, like, congrats, congrats. Yeah. I was like, no idea what you're talking about, but I guess I'll look it up. No, but um, no, that was really cool. Um, it's just a watch list, so I'm just, I'm just hoping I, I got a ball out and represent our, my culture correct. So. But are, are you um, American Samoa? Samoa. Samoa. Yeah, so, okay, yeah. okay. Your parents are from there, or? Yeah, both of my parents are. Okay. Did, did Idaho's success with some Polynesian players play into your role, play into the factor of wanting to come here at all? Or? Like uh, Big Mike. Big Mike and other Yeah, guys. I actually I, I actually had no clue where Idaho was. Okay. But until uh, they're like, oh, we got to do sent to the Niners. My favorite team is the Niners. So I was like, who? Like, the Niners. All right. Mike. I was like, geez, all right, I'm going there, I guess. <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, for sure. Um, really, it's just a big a big culture. It's a big culture thing with the Polish. So mm-hmm. that's cool. What other schools were you working at? Did some of them you said were recruiting as you as an athlete? Is that right? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, like BYU, Utah State, um, Utah, Stanford. I wasn't too, I wasn't smart enough to get into Stanford. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, other than that, that's about it. And Idaho appealed to you because you were able, because they had a big, kind of a, a vision that. You, no, or, it's uh, or, or. no. Everything happens for a reason. Um, I, all my offers came in early. Um, I was so young. You know, I wasn't really thinking about college. So like uh, my sophomore, junior year, it was kind of like, all right, I got to put this off. I'm trying to win state or whatever. My head was in high school. Um, but no, it turned out great for me. Uh, I'm glad where I'm at. Cool. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.